so I won't be using these after all. Okay, this is a quick sketch, of just roughly where I'm at right now. 55 gallon drum with this oven box sticking out of the center, which I'm getting ready, ready to weld right here. There's the box, I made it seven inches. So I'm seven by 12 right now. Here's the top and bottom plate. what I've got in my head so far yeah. two coils I didn't show that but there's going to be two coils one above the oven and one below the oven that's not drawn quite uh, I'm thinking four fans cinder blocks again blowing in at the bottom cold air in and then the hot air out at the top the dimensions I don't know exactly yet the barrel will be internal so I'm going to have insulation seven inches approximately of insulation of this high temperature uh, rock wool insulation and then I'm going to have another metal box so you got the 55 gallon drum in this internal the oven coming out full of sand I didn't write that but this obviously going to be full of sand in here and then this is air. Okay, put a little, a little more detail in here. It'll be sand in the 55 gallon drum. And then this is an air pocket, similar to that very first uh, prototype I have out there. So that air, I'll draw the hot air out of this air uh, reservoir or whatever you want to call this compartment. And this will be all insulation. That's the theory. And then the oven in the middle. Now I, I'm, I've already worked with these uh, cooking foods, so I'm about 99% sure the oven should work fairly well. I, I can't swear to, you know, each one's going to be different depending on the ratio of sand to the heat to the wattage to the whole thing. But at least this one I can get completed uh, fairly quick. I need this for my new property. If anybody's been waiting, it's me to see how these things will work. The main thing is get this baby going and it's going now. Somebody mentioned in a comment about a 55 gallon drum design that they had. And it got me to thinking I did have this one 55 gallon drum. I think all it had was lacquer and it's been sitting for years. That would be a much more basic design and I need something quick. Also, everybody else would like to know how to make something basic and get to the bottom of how well this works. I'm still working on the details, but it's gonna be much uh, much easier than the two planners. I won't have to drill through that clay that I'm about to cut the top off of here now. top cut off but the bottom is rusted not super bad but bad enough there's a couple holes like either way I got this 09 I'll weld it in cut it and reinforce this reinforced bottom I think it's like a 090 steel plate a little bit less than three millimeters I was back and forth on whether or not to put an oven in here because it gets kind of involved and I got to cut through the insulation and but I was thinking about them cold nights Here's my beginning of my oven compartment. 
I already had these little 10 inch pizza stones. I got two of these last year. I've been collecting parts for a while, ever since I started this project. Just some of it I haven't gotten to. Then I'll put a stainless plate on here, just yeah. I can pull it out and clean it and put it back in. There's all the parts for the oven. Got a little more welding on this. A little more welding and sanding and cutting. There's my oven box. Hopefully I'll be eating snacks out of there this winter. <laughs>